Hello, hello everybody. You uh, find me stuck in a room that I cannot get out of. And uh, yeah, I, I honestly don't know what to do really. Um, yeah, welcome back to Inscription. Um, I was gonna say, let's head back to the start screen because you know, why not? And see if something had changed. Um, uh-huh. Okay, there's a new game option. Because last time at the beginning, we were forced to continue. I should have realized that looked like a new game button in the last episode, but you know, I was being dumb. But yes, welcome in everybody. We're starting a new game of Inscription. Woo! <laughs> oh, hello. This is a BIOS log. Can I... Renewal. Start a new game. In the beginning, the world did not know cards. That is, until the day the scribes arrived. That bottom one looks like Leshy. Each had their own method of inscription to create cards. Remora used her quill to inscribe the epitaphs of the dead. Leshy used his wildlife camera to capture beasts. PO3 used a particle scanner to copy the CPUs of robots. And Magnificus, that's another one we've heard, used his brush to paint his wizard pupils. With the cards created, the scribes had solidified their power. Until one day, a challenger arrived to replace one of the scribes. Interesting. Choose a starting deck to mark your ambition. So, what? PO3 and become the scribe of technology. Magnificus and become the scribe of magic. Magic the Gathering deck, let's go. Um, replace Leshy and become the scribe of beasts. Or Grimora and become Scribe of the Dead. Um, look, I'm gonna be honest, there's the me who's like Magic the Gathering deck. Let's go. Um, or there's the me who's like, this sounds cool because Undeath in this game was really good. And I'm betting, so here's the thing, I'm betting this is a bone flavored deck. I'm betting this is a um, normal deck of Inscription. I'm betting this is tech, and I'm betting this is something entirely different. So these two are new mechanics. So my current thought process is, is I want to play one of these two decks. Um, you know what? Here. Er, hang on. Let me, let me, I don't know, I don't know if you got that at all. I'm opening up my dice container. I'm rolling for evens or odds, and if it is even, I will do um, the ma 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 uh, Magnificus deck. If it's odd, I will do the PO3 deck. It is even, starting with Magnificus. All right. Well, there we go. Dice put away. Let's do this. Take the deck. The cards were added to your collection. So, what? Ah, alter deck. That's good to know. Okay, so we have... We don't have a deck at all right now. So we just have all of these. So we have Mox. Can't be sacrificed. While they're on the board, it provides gems. What are the gems? Um, controls no mox cards, this perishes, so it can exist as long as there's a mox on the field. Um, provides, so each of those provide three colors, and then these guys down here 
do something else. You are just a 1-2. You're a 1-3 as long as there's Mox. And then Blue Mage, uh, you draw cards equal to the amount of Mox cards on your side of the board. Interesting. So, I'm going to be honest. Yeah, it looks like the starter deck is just meant to be um, as much as we can put in right now. What is this? That was what I was going to say. Um, we can't go this way. Hello? Whew! I was just about to call it quits out here. But now that there's a challenger in our midst, it's back to work for me. I should be able to get this bridge fixed in... Full disclosure, it'll take me exactly as long as it takes you to defeat one of those scribes. So, uh, come back later. Interesting. Gotta gather that momentum. Look, you seem like a fine enough player, so I'll fill you in a bit. These scribes are crazy out here. Always at each other's necks. Desperate struggle for power, you know? Just stay out of it. You don't want to end up like them. Woof, it's time to get back to work. Woof. Woof. Okay, you're a dog. I get it. Um, let's go say hi to the cabin. Two equals three? Question mark? It, oh my gosh, that's the angler. No. No fish, no pass. Okay. There's a roof. You pried the chest open and found a card pack inside. You received a beastly card pack. Ooh. Okay, Gem Fiend. That's a good card. Urayuli, a bullfrog, a bloodhound, and a null conduit. May complete a circuit, but it provides no effect. The cards were added to my collection. I want to go here, get rid of one of you, add one of you. Because, yeah, that's a good one. Gem Fiend looks interesting. What about you? Dang damn it! That dang hound got herself lost! Again! Think you're getting fast? Think again! Not till I get some proof my girl's alright. Okay, fine. You hired a hearing? Give me some proof she's alright. Maybe get her some food. Come to think of it, might have left some in that dang cabin. Okay, fine. Alright, cool. Oh my gosh, we were just here. It's the safe. Can I? Can I do this? Oh my gosh. You take a stinking pile of meat from the safe. Oh my gosh. Paint odor where that was. Are these? Oh my gosh. They do. They are still here. That's awesome. Okay, so one, two, you're locked. You're gonna jump in front of anything, so we need to deal nine damage. Holy cow. Um, or we have you go through. Mm-hmm. I mean, that is more damage. We can do that. That is enough damage to get it killed. So that's only four. Uh huh. Um, interesting. How do I get you killed? Um, wait a minute. Flying damage goes over the head. Correct, but not enough. There it is. I was like, hang on, I think it's that. 
The drawer creaked open and you found a pack inside. Beastly card pack. Field mice. When field mice is played, a copy of it is created. Holy cow, that's broken. Um, I'm surprised I never got this. Um, Yep, yep, yep. And these conduits. Yep. They're interesting. Added to the collection. And another beastly card pack. Ooh, another blue mage. And a squirrel ball. Squirrel ball will move in the direction of Scribe and Central and drop a squirrel in its place. That is such an interesting card. I I feel like some of these cards weren't in Leshy's Cabin because that is an awesome card and I actually like that card idea. So can I do this? Oh my gosh, there's just a random squirrel. Can I walk into here? Oh, this is where you are. You wish to trade. You don't perchance have pelts? No, that is disappointing. But I also accept foils. The Ouroboros is still the same. Oh, great. That's... That honestly makes me feel sad that the Ouroboros does what it does. I don't like it. Um, hang on. Let's talk to you. Stop shaking. The only thing you have to fear is your own inadequacy. Behold me, I am Leshy, the scribe of peace. We share a desire for you to challenge me, but first... I know what you're thinking. No, this is not my legendary camera. Not the one I use to create beast cards. This one is a mere replica. You may use it to create photos of the beasts in the woods. My subordinates, the prospector, the angler, and the trapper, they each require a photo before they will consider battling you. Return to me when they are all defeated. Turn to me when my subordinates are defeated. You may wish to start with the prospector. Interesting. Can I walk behind you anywhere else at all? Any secrets with the walls at all? Any unique, interesting things to hide against these? Like, at all? Can I move diagonal? I can't. That's going to be very annoying in my opinion also I didn't check if there was a door there at all we will put that there I don't know why that says 2 equals 3 but I have gotten the dog pictured okay um how is my deck looking because, in all honesty, I'm like, dude, there's stuff that I didn't even see while I was playing the game that now I'm wishing that I got, basically. Let's do this. Well, I'll be darned. That's my girl. I'll let you pass me and into yonder pond. But dang, man, it. First we got about, oh, that's 273. That's two seven three. That's meant to be a seven. That's a really bad seven. That looks like two equals three. The Prospector. Mm -hmm. Greetings, my consciousness has been summoned, it seems. But for what purpose? Ah, you have selected my starter deck and require a short lesson. You see, magical cars are powered by mocks, though some refer to them as gems. If you have one of these mocks on the board, you may play cards with that cost. Start by playing one. Um, so we have a green in hand. I'm going to play this. You see, now you may play magical cards of that gem's color. It's quite simple, really. I cannot comprehend now my students sometimes struggle. But I have digressed. Carry on. I await you atop my tower interesting so not a blue gem okay and this is that's a sacrifice thing i think can i yeah i'm betting that's how you sack things it's weird that it's a hammer um where's my there's my bell 
interesting. There's power, there's sack, there's that. Um, we do have a mox on the battlefield, so I'm going to do that. And we're going to... I keep thinking my button is there. Damage dealt. Damage taken. So, hang on. I know I don't have orange. So if I place you here, in front of the squirrel, break you. Oh! That's not sac- Oh! Can't be sacrificed. Durr, I misread. Anyways, but that made bones? Bloodhound leaps over the block. Interesting. The hammer exists. I'm gonna be honest, this is looking like a crappy deck. I'm just glad that I'm playing it well enough. Fair's fair, you beat me like a dog. Take this, some say these here cards are better than gold. Received a beastly card. Interesting, a crockle. Also, it provides energy cells. Thick Druid, Broken Obel. Striker is dealt a single damage point. Interesting, I'm betting there's one that's the other half of this. Yeah. The way to yonder pond is clear. Don Brady makes you. Off with you. The way to yonder pond is clear. Okay, fine, off I go. fish and then I want to see this take the photo place the photo of bait on the line does does this work oh my gosh fish I I did not expect that to work can I hello what the heck Uh, who are you, why are you here, and why did I just randomly guess where a secret is? Why is there a person of what looks to be a female there? Can I do something? Can I, like, turn? This is a weird idea. If I turn my brightness down, does... Okay, no. I was like, if I turn my brightness down, does it turn the thing down? Noise effect? Question mark? No. Okay, fine. We will continue. Now that I know that there is that stuff, that's insane. I'm gonna be checking, like, everywhere. Fish? Fresh fish. Good. Still must beat the angler. Interesting. Salmon. Yeah, there's there's a fair few new cards. Maybe maybe Field Mice is just a new card. And I just didn't see it. Um Waterborne also at the end of turn, salmon will move in the direction inscribed on the sigil. It's a 2-2 for Yeah, that sucks. Ow. That hurts. Um, let's do this. Let's hit a bit. You're gonna move there. Salmon moves to a new space. Let's do this. Deal a fair bit of damage. Salmon emerges from the deep. Salmon moves to a new space. And just win. Excess damage is how you get foils, okay. That's good to know. You beat, you pass. First, take. You received a beastly card pack. Interesting. Okay. Um, Urayuli. Again, not really meh. And an Emerald Mox. Okay. Cards were added to the deck. Me? Work continue. Find fish for less fleshy. Leshy want good fish. Fresh fish. Corrupted fish. 
corrupted fish, lest you trust, I not disappoint. Find corrupted fish. Fresh fish? No, lest you want corrupted. I find sometime. Always do. Me work continue. Find fish for Leshy. Interesting. Something about corrupted fish. So the trapper wanted a pelt. I'm betting I have to do a puzzle that makes. Oh my gosh, there's more. The woodcarver, you're here. Few players visit me here. I sometimes ponder what my gameplay purpose was. Oh, it's clear now that you wish to know more. What can I tell you? I have glimpsed the old underscore data, and I will speak nothing of it as a kindness. I will repeat myself, I will speak nothing of the old data. I know it is to die, but you players are never deterred by that. What can I tell you? It is corrupt knowledge so evil that it corrupted this disc. Inscription the good? No. What can you know? Asked the scribes. They don't seem to care for human life. Leave me to ponder and carve my wood. Bring Leshy's... Being Leshy's puppet has given me much to ponder. Goodbye for now. Interesting. So you were never under Leshy's control, you were merely just a means to the end, and the mask was something about your character. Interesting. Well, alright, we open this. Patches of dried blood crackled as you pried the chest open, but two packs were inside. Interesting. Hover mage. Even if there's no creature opposing it, that's good. I will add you instead of something else. And another hover mage. It sh looks shiny. Yeah. Cards were added to the collection. Okay, um, let's get rid of mage pupil and add in two new ones of you. And you know what? We can get rid of a mage pupil and add in one of you. Like, yeah, I think, yeah, I'm a bit scared by this deck, in all honesty. It feels like not a lot of damage. Any chance I can move would the mycologist be around here? No, no, why, why do you hop in? So if I go here, you go here, if I stand here, you do that, if I stand here, oh, can I pick this up? Oh, I can move it. Okay. That's good to know. Can I move it out? That might be something. Oh no. If it goes with me off the screen, I'm done. I'm done because that means that this is a horribly well thought out secret and I have no idea what to do with it. Can you go off the screen? It does not go off the screen with me. Um, I might have soft locked. It's, I might have soft locked actually. You know, I, I'm, I'm curious, has anybody tried this before? Is there a reason that the game would just let you soft lock like this? Can I? Oh no. Oh no. Um, oh no. Have I soft locked, like, really bad? I'm gonna go to start. Hang on. Continue. I'm assuming this pulls us back to here. Okay, thank God. We saved it. I was like, uh-oh. 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 
Okay, so now if I go stand here, you're not gonna like either of the two. It's a weird bunny. It's weird that it's green. And it immediately becomes a pelt. Why not take the pelt? Okay, uh, cool. Let's go fight the trapper and traitor, I guess. So interesting, this area. Leshy, poor hair, take that photo to the traitor. She is to your right. You, you have brought up health. I am pleased. Yet another turn of the skinning knife. It is time to set another trap. I smell the hare's blood on you. Trapper and traitor. Alrighty, so we got a blue mox. Uh, what are you gonna do? Draw cards equal to the amount of mox cards on your side of the board. So we want two down, effectively. A 0-5 burrowing trap. Yikes. Blue mage draws on the power of your gems. Okay, well, this is what we got. I do want to get rid of this card as soon as possible, though. Um, yeah, we have orange. I'm assuming that's good to know. You don't need to have the card in effect to actually beat it. Burrowing Trap digs down and pops out to block. Okay, interesting. Let's set you down here so that you do a lot. Okay, um, we now don't have any mocks. We don't have enough, really, I feel like. Burring Trap digs down and pops up to block. Burring Trap snaps shut. Interesting. Okay. Um, let's go here. Let's reduce damage dealt to me. And then another green mox. So we will put this here. I will do that so that we're gaining damage. I will do this so that we're neutral in terms of damage. Um, I keep drawing. I break this. I place you. We keep going basically. Um, Yep, we slowly tip the scales, basically. Um, hmm. Okay, so I can hammer this out, put you down, hammer you down, place you here. So now I'm slowly breaking you down. Which will eventually neutralize the damage. Um, if I break you, place you, break you, place you, we now start winning. Zero cards in deck, but that is enough to do it. The trap has shut, yet the prey escapes and the trapper waits for the next victim. You've defeated the three of us now. Leshy awaits. Received a beastly card pack and a muscle mage. Interesting. Um, and the walkers. Interesting. So it costs the same as it plays. Um, yeah, you wash you wish to trade, yes, I do. Um, ooh, hey, it's a stoat. 
Okay. Yeah, you know, um... Gosh, I'm gonna be honest. This is a really hard deck. This is, like, really hard for a deck. And also... Hold on. Why did it not save? Yeah, I was playing a completely different deck. Than what I had put in. That's unfair. Excuse me. Alright, well, fine then. Um... Yeah, let's get rid of you. Oh, I've got one more that I can put in. Yeah, let's put you there. Can I save it now? Is it the correct deck? Okay, it is. I don't know why it didn't save last time. <sighs> Alright. Leshy, let's do this. And then I think... You've bested the Unhinged Prospector, the Gormless Anger, and the Enigmatic Trapper. You found yourself standing before your ultimate match, Leshy, Scribe of the Beasts. Steal yourself, for my beasts will show you no mercy, only fangs. Do not spare your creatures. My camera is waiting to capture them at the moment of their demise. And my beasts are famished. So if something dies, he's gonna pull it back on his side. Okay. So what also makes it even worse is that they are all actually genuinely strong creatures as well, too. I'm betting. Let's do this. Get rid of you. This is a remix of the moon theme! Oh, that's sick! I love that! You're gonna kill that. I'll need a photo of that one's cost. Oh, so it isn't like that. He's just getting cards from it. I think, in the long run. Oh, that's sick. I love this. I love this idea. I'm gonna keep the Mox in hand. One moment. Before that one dies, I'll need the capture. It's stats. Um, uh, so I hate to alarm you. We do not have very good things. I should make sure he doesn't kill any mox cards right now because he needs mox cards to play oh i got him you won't be needing those i have something better hmm we never did finish your death card there wasn't enough death hope you don't mind my filling in the blanks oh no oh no that's actually worse that's worse um amalgams interesting they're all one ones. Wonderful. Um, Mole Man digs down and pops out to block. I'm gonna do this. And then we can sacrifice you. I will put you there. This will go in a turn, I think. Bull man digs down and pops up to block. Um, let's grab you and just keep feeding the beast, essentially. Digs down and pops up to block. We've gotten one down. Now we just need the mox is the issue. Oh my gosh. Don't throw out the eight grizzly bear play again. I I will be very upset if you do it, Leshy. Don't you dare eight grizzly bear me again. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, this does not look winnable. I lose. 
How utterly disappointing. I was hoping for a greater challenge. It was all over so quickly. Oh, if I could extend the struggle, for the kill is only as satisfying as the struggle that precedes it. Interesting. Okay. Let's alter the deck. Um, I'm gonna be honest. I don't like that deck. I really don't like that deck. It's not good at all. Um, let's see here. So I need something that's easily sacrificable and gives blood. Or... Other creatures within a circuit gain this. There's a bull hound. Yeah, you know what? We can do this and the Hrockal. And what I will do is we can play with a new um, version of the deck. I need a Mole Man. See, the issue is, is right now I need power. I don't know. I need a... I, I'm curious if these give blood. If they give blood, then it's fine. If not, I'm scared because I don't know how to do it. And I feel like I've weakened myself massively. Like, I need a squirrel. I need to... Yep, yeah, put said squirrel in. Auto complete. Junior Sage. Just Junior Sage? That that's what you put in. No No safety, no nothing. Um let's get rid of Bolt Hound and the thick droid autocomplete for emerald box times two i believe might be better i know it can't be sacrificed but it gives us a a way to get things out i feel um gosh i also need to make sure so yeah i'm thinking squirrel balls are gonna be really helpful um rock all will be nice like we just need to get started basically yep i crave a true challenge let's do this my camera is poised show me something worthwhile okay so i can first off can i play you and then can i Okay, that makes things a lot nicer. Warren pulls out a rabbit. Interesting. Okay, so energy works like mana, essentially. So, I want to play this. And then I need to... Yeah, we need to basically start completing circuits as best and as soon as we possibly can interesting so i'm gonna put the mocks there that does make me feel more confident in getting this done now next stats that's not good um let's have you go there I will have you go here, you can do that, and now you will may complete a circuit, but provides no effects. Oh, so the middle cards get the benefit. We need cards in the middle of it. And finally, the sigils, nothing. That will do. The deaths of your creatures will form a beautiful mosaic, also known as no mosaic effectively yeah i messed that up um i concede i have to yep i need to concede and modify okay um so squirrel warren warren that that um that 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 
we like you, I like those cards, and then tech noises out the wazoo. Um, we will make the final card that we go for. That's a really big boy. Um, we'll do Bolt Hound, why not? Give me an earn earnest effort. Well, now that I can. Fresh meat for my beasts. Alrighty, so another thing I want to test um, is, well, not that, I guess. Um, let's put you here. We'll get a rabbit and we'll blockade it here. Um, and then hit the button. Before that one dies, it's cost free, which is good. Sigil or numbers was a zero two. That's not good. Okay, um, let's get you down. And this will be one damage. 49er moves to a new place. I never really liked the cards that move a lot. Um, so this will be interesting for me. That one moves to a new spot, moves to a new space. All we need now is the sigils. It was nothing because you died first. I'm gonna be honest, this deck might just be impossible. Um, okay, cool. Now, yes I know. I I think I need to not rely on the Yeah, I need a stronger deck and I need to rot not rely on these cards, I feel like. Which sucks because the new ones look so cool and I like them and they're interesting and I want to play with them, but no, I can't. Um let's do that. And let's get a squirrel ball out of the deck so that I can play those two. Yeah, that looks good. Maybe. Steal yourself. Okay, think of the death card we can create this time. Well, first off, let's go with a you and I want you provides an energy cell you can get rid of that coyote and then go down and hide proc all emerges from the deep okay um we just deal the damage we balance out basically emerge from the deep let's see here I think we just keep balancing for right now, which sucks because we're not actually balanced. Croc all emerges from the deep. Let's do this so that we can do this. I play you here and then I play the field mice. The field mice reproduce. Um, and then we get rid of the stokes and nearly get rid of this. Croc all emerges, it emerges from the deep. Let's go this, mold digs down and pops out. We keep damage neutral, minus one actually. Um, let's do that. And then in all honesty, I actually do need this. To go through like that yeah mole man pops out and digs to block adder's touch of death kills instantly i forgot before that one dies it's cost one um oh hey look it's my squirrel finally here to be helpful um let's do this this should balance us out a bit Wolf Cub transcends to a higher form. Yeah, that's good. Um, so we're gonna lose a bit of health here. 
digs down and pops up to block. It's all right. Um, so we're gonna lose the wolf after this turn, but that's okay. Yep, a moment, I need the stats. A one for a three, two, that's pretty good. Um, yeah, this sucks because, yep, we're, we're taking damage this turn. I need something that heals damage here. Okay, that's good. You are perfectly fine. Yep, let's grab you, let's put you down. You can go like this. Mole Man digs down and pops up to block. And then, let's see here. So, you're dying again this turn. So let's do that. And then, let's get some damage dealt. And off we go. These are inferior cards, let's replace them. I had to take some liberties with this one. There wasn't enough death. Ooh. Interesting. One cost three twos that are part mole man, apparently. Um, let's sack you so that we can get the money or the stuff to bring all of these out. I did the wrong one there. Yeah, this should be fine. We're gonna take four right out of the get-go, but we also should immediately heal stuff shortly after. Yeah, this is good. Okay. Just keep hitting, I think we win. Money gained, foils. The great scribe was incredibly bested. Far away, a light enveloped a long forgotten monument. Interesting. Well, avenging druid, complete the temple of beasts. Your triumph, narrowly avoiding tooth and claw, the scribe of beasts was defeated. That you were able to defeat me beggars belief. But now I must yield to you. My only regret is that our battle was so brief. Surely the summit of victory is made sweeter by a more arduous ascent. I agree. You received a beastly card pack. Ooh, Mantis. Mantis God, that's good. And a ghost ship. Ooh, that's awesome. I like that. And leave a skeleton. Oh my gosh. There's some good cards. Beastly card pack, another one, and a revenant. Oh my gosh. Battery low, the scribes of beasts was defeated. Stop. What is that? Uh, oh. I had to see your face after you lost. You're just so bad. It's no wonder we're back here again. And we and it would would have been even sooner if the disc and we would have been even sooner if the disc wasn't lost. Take a long look at this face. It's the stoat. You'll never see it again. I'm done being your pet, you stinking beast! Oh my gosh. PO3 was the stout. I pushed it too far that last time. Why don't they see? To live as a beast would be the noblest thing. Even so lowly a creature as a stout. Interesting. Well, um... Yeah! That's interesting obviously we're swapping these out for this and uh we're swapping out the i could use that actually we'll swap out a bullfrog for you so that you're more easy to get in and a bullfrog for you so you're more easy to get in but yeah with that all said and done thank you so much everybody for watching I'll see y'all in the next episode. 
Have a good one. Bye-bye.